Hey everybody, this is Will. I was excited to see uh, just a few moments ago, actually go live on YouTube, that Renewed Vision announced uh, ProPresenter 7.9. And uh, I thought uh, I would watch the video. I'm glad I did because I realized in the video that Cody announced that ProPresenter has a brand new MIDI cube. So if you open uh, ProPresenter 7.9, uh, you go to Devices, go to MIDI Map. Uh, you'll notice that there's a new Clear Announcements MIDI queue. Now, in ProPresenter 7.6, they added the Trigger Macro commands, and so I had already updated my MIDI queues file to have the new Trigger Macro commands. Uh, but now, my ProPresenter MIDI queues file has been updated to include a Clear Announcements queue. So that's both the free ProPresenter MIDI queue. So if you go to from studiostage.com slash ProPresenter, uh, even if you've already downloaded this before, head back to the page, you can re-download. Um, and you can grab the new cues for ProPresenter 7.9, which again includes that new clear announcements trigger and the trigger macro cue. Now, one point I do want to min uh, mention with this, uh, because I have to update this file, it does require Ableton Live 10.1. Uh, there will not be a version for Ableton Live 10. There will not be a version for Ableton Live 9. Uh, the previous version was just for Ableton Live 10. <clears throat> this does require Ableton Live 10.1. Uh, it's a free update if you're on 10. Uh, and that's standard or higher. Uh, I also did update the paid ProPresenter uh, 7 MIDI cues. Um, again, this requires Ableton Live 10.1. Uh, but when you download it, uh, you get the new clear announcements trigger uh in the trigger macro queue as well uh one thing i want to mention the way i program this in order for you to use this in pro presenter uh what you'll need to do is go into preferences which is command comma go to devices hopefully you've already added midi if not then check out the the very many pro presenter queue uh pro presenter tutorials i've done or the pro presenter course if you're from studio stage student uh, but you add your MIDI device, go to MIDI map. You'll see the new announcements queue here, MIDI message queue here. Uh, under clear commands, by default, yours will look like this. It'll be uh, empty. There'll be nothing there. Um, if you're just using my cues and you haven't customized any cues, then just go up to zero and hit autofill. Uh, and it'll autofill to use note 30 uh, or F sharp zero. Um, if you have some sort of custom cues, then you know, you'll know you have to tweak the MIDI cues file that uh, I created, but the, the cue that I have here is F sharp zero. Uh, so that's all available both in the free ProPresenter cues, which again, you can get at from studiostage.com slash ProPresenter. It uh, does require Ableton Live 10.1, as well as the, um, the ProPresenter 7 paid MIDI cues that includes, again, all 100 what is it, 27 or whatever it is, uh, cues in the entire file. Uh, I will mention if you have purchased the ProPresenter mini cues, um, you do not have to repurchase this, but you will have to email support at fromstudiostage.com uh, to get a new download link to download that. Uh, and again, if you've already purchased or already uh, downloaded the free cues, just go back here and re-download. You don't have to email support to get that link. You can go at any time to re-download. Uh, but I'm super excited for this. Uh, congrats to Renewed Vision on the new updates and new progress they have. Uh, and I'm excited to see every time they add a new MIDI queue and we'll continue to keep updating that uh, MIDI queues file whenever there's a new update. Thanks so much for watching. Uh, if you're watching on YouTube, do me a favor, hit subscribe, turn on the bell icon, uh, particularly if those free queues have been helpful to you. That's a way just to say thanks. Um, and uh, release a new video every single day, 10 a.m. Central. So I'd love to see you uh, hang around the channel and check that content out. Take care, everybody. See you on the next one. Bye.